Three Ugly Feet, loosely based on the Joseph Jacobs version of the folk tale, The Three Little Pigs. There was an old sock with the three ugly feet, and as she had not enough to keep up with them, she sent them out to seek their fortune. The first that went off met a tidy whities with a bundle of concrete. concrete. Play out. Please, Tidy Whities, give me that Play-Doh to build myself an Eiffel Tower. The Tidy Whities did, and the Ugly Feet built an Eiffel Tower with it. Pre- presently, presently came along a squirrel. Ugly Feet, Ugly Feet, let me come in. No, no, not by the hair of my nosy nose nose. Then I'll poop, and I'll cry, and I'll itch your Eiffel Tower in. So he pooped, and he cried, and he itched his Eiffel Tower in, and ate up the little foot. The second ugly foot met the door with the marshmallows. Please, door, give me that those marshmallows to build myself an Eiffel Tower. The door did, and the ugly foot built an Eiffel Tower with it. Presently came along a squirrel. Ugly foot, ugly foot, let me come in. No, no, not by the hair of my nosy nose nose. Then I'll poop, and I'll cry, and I'll itch your Eiffel Tower in. So he pooped, and he cried, and he itched his Eiffel Tower in. And ate up the little foot. The third ugly foot met a flip-flop with gum. Please, flip-flop, give me that gum to build myself myself an Eiffel Tower. The flip-flop did, and the ugly foot built an Eiffel Tower with it. Presently, it came along a squirrel. Ugly foot, ugly foot, let me come in. No, no, not by the hair of my nosy nose nose. Then I'll poop and I'll cry and I'll itch your Eiffel Tower in. Well, he pooped and he cried and he itched the Eiffel Tower in. He pooped and he cried and he pooped and he cried and he pooped and he cried. But he could not get the Eiffel Tower down. When he found that he could not, with all this poop and cry, itch the Eiffel Tower down. He had to think of something else. Ugly, ugly foot. I know where there's a nice field of green beans with ketchup. Where? Oh, in George Washington's home field. And if you'll be ready tomorrow morning, I will call for you and we will go together and get some for dinner. Very well. I will be ready. What time do you mean to go? Oh, at six o'clock. Well, the ugly foot got up at five and got the green beans with ketchup before the squirrel came. Ugly foot, are you ready? Ready, I've been in, come back again, and I have a nice pot full for dinner. The squirrel felt very angry at this but thought that he would get the ugly foot somehow or other. Ugly foot, I know where there's a nice banana tree. Where? Down at Giggly Garden, and I will come for you at five o'clock tomorrow and get some bananas. Well, the ugly foot woke up the next morning at four o'clock and went off for the banana, hoping to get back before the squirrel came. But he had further to go. He had to climb the tree, so just as he was coming down from it, he saw the squirrel coming. Ugly foot, are you here before me? Are they nice bananas? Yes, and I will throw you one down. The ugly foot threw it so far. While the squirrel was going to pick it up, the ugly foot jumped down and ran home. The next day, the squirrel came again. 
Ugly Foot, there's a George Washington's gift shop at the Grand Canyon. Will you go? Oh, yes, I will go. What time shall you be ready? At three. So the Ugly Foot went off before time as usual and got the George Washington gift shop and bought a bowl which was going home with. When he saw the squirrel coming, then he could not tell what to do. So he got into the bowl to hide. And by doing, turned around, he rolled down the hill, which foot in it. Which frightened the squirrel so much that he ran home without going to George Washington's gift shop. Ugly foot. I was so frightened by this great round thing which came down the hill past me on my way to George Washington's gift shop. I don't know what it was. Ha, huh, I frighten you then. I had been to George Washington's gift shop and bought a bowl, and when I saw you, I got into it and rolled down the hill. I have had enough. I am going to eat you, ugly foot, right now. <laughs>